Hello to all of the Virgos out there, Sun, Rising, and Venus. Welcome to Visions of Light and Love. This is your reading for the week of May 3rd through May 9th. This reading is for all of my Virgos, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of May 3rd through May 9th. If you are a returning viewer, welcome back. If this is your first time stopping by, welcome to Visions of Light and Love. If the reading does not resonate with your situation, check out the Moon, Venus, and Rising Sign videos. Cross watchers are welcome as well. If you like my energy, my vibe, you feel like I am the reader for you, and you would like to show some support, hit the subscription link along with the notification bell so that you are notified when new videos are posted. Also, hit the thumbs up image so that this video circulates and reaches someone else that needs clarity, enlightenment, and guidance pertaining to their situation and love or finances. Private readings, if you need one, you can check the description box for the link along with some other links that may interest you. Okay, Virgos, we are going to shuffle and then cut this deck and start your reading. Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Thank you to all of my new subscribers. Also, comment below if this resonates with your situation. Okay, Swear, what is the energy for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? What is the energy for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Okay, coming out in your own reading with the Hermit. The Hermit card is there. Okay. Let's see what this is. The Seven of Cups. We have the Hermit. The Seven of Cups. <laughs> okay. The Six of Swords. Okay. Okay. Wise Counselor. Wise Counselor. Why is this wise counselor here for my Virgos? Cards are coming right out. Justice, Libra's energy is here. We have the awakening. Okay. The ace of swords. The eight of pentacles. Mine, remember this could be your energy or your partner or someone in your heart space. Okay, that's too many. That is too many. We don't need all of those. One more. There we go. Thank you. The Empress. Libra, Taurus energy. So you could be um, with this Ten of Pentacles working on this financial stability for a family. Um, thinking about retirement. Um, just focusing on financial security for yourself as well as your family is what I'm saying. Could be passing on knowledge to someone at this time as well. With this Hermit card and this Seven of Cups, I see you. Um, I see you at a peaceful place, taking time out to focus on yourself. To focus on yourself. Um, self-discovery, just looking at the light within you, focusing on you so that um, you can stop over analyzing things, procrastinating. I feel like you are making a choice to move towards peace and harmony in your life with your family. That's what I'm seeing. You are making a choice. Could be you, could be your partner. Someone is making a choice, has made a choice. And I feel like it's you, Virgo, made a choice to move towards peace and harmony within your family or with your family. Some of you may be traveling soon or thinking about relocating and looking for a new home. With this wise counselor, you could be coming up with new ideas, getting advice from someone about your finances to balance things out for you. I see you standing up for things that you believe in, going with the integrity part of a characteristics or traits and leaving the rest behind with their justice card. 
with this awakening, again, I'm seeing you taking a pause and reflecting on yourself. Embracing your own uniqueness. And just seeing life and seeing things from a whole new perspective. Some of you could be looking at tarot videos or... Get, get, um, You could be a tarot readers as well. But I'm seeing you overcoming obstacles. Someone may be overcoming um, immature behavior. Could be a child or have something to do with a kid. I see something being worked on. Some type of communication taking place. After someone was left out in the cold for immature behavior. I see a union being worked on. Yeah, something is going to be nurtured. Could be with a father, a mother, with this Empress card. Someone, um, someone is coming in to work on this situation so that it's nurtured and it grows. Okay, so let's see what else Spirit has for you, Virgos. Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Let's see what else the cards have to, have to say. Um, one more time. The number four. I, I'm seeing stability coming in with that number four. Okay, what other messages do you have for the sign of Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus? Okay. So we have a new stable beginning. Again, something coming in. New and st stable with the Ace of Pentacles. Okay, yep. Working on a situation, a new beginning. Eight of Pentacles. So this is something that you may have manifested with this Magician card. So that time of reflection may have resulted in you manifesting this. And with this Empress card, and this King of Swords and the Empress card, you may have or may or will have an honest communication with someone so that this this union can grow and so that you can nurture it and it can blossom into something better. I see you taking action or this person, someone is going to take action. No longer feeling wounded, no longer being in their feelings or emotions about this um reconnecting i see someone putting their pride aside yeah and deciding to come in and work on this situation after taking a time out right now may be um the time to do it with the three of um wines someone is coming in someone is coming in mm -hmm. yep a reconnection again Six of Cups could be reconnected with someone from your childhood. Could have something to do with kids. Someone has gone through some type of transformation with this. Um, could be a Scorpio, this death card. Putting, a, putting an end to childish ways. And there, someone is coming in quickly to reconnect. After going through some type of transformation. Taking a time out to reflect on things that may have happened. Mm-hmm. Yeah, someone took it some time out with their Nine of Pentacles. Now you you have stability within a family or finances that's coming back in. Aquarius energy, the star card. Someone has healed from a situation. So they're coming back in hoping that they can no longer feel in regret and remorse and disappointment. But now they're ready to come back in and balance things out with their Justice card, Libra's energy. Someone was blind in the past and in their ego and pride I'm hearing. And now they're coming in to put an effort for success with their three of pentacles. Someone's willing to put in the work. Mm -hmm. Again, this could be a younger person with their page. With this page. Yeah, a younger person that's coming in, taking, coming in to offer a cup of their love. Or either you. After being still and not taking action. Someone is coming back in. They're bored, discontent, 
and don't um yeah they're tired of being toxic look the hermit in reverse this person is coming back in they want a second chance scorpio energy capricorn's energy virgo's energy is here twice Someone is coming back in. They're tired of feeling left out in the cold after a tower moment took place. This person wants to come back in and celebrate. They want to come back in and have some type of celebrate, maybe a couple of drinks. They want to be honest. They want to have an honest conversation with you or you, them. Someone is coming back in. Spirit, what other energy? What other messages do you have for a sign? Okay. Hands of cards. Someone is going to take the risk. They, this person is coming back in. They're coming back in to have this new beginning. You have the Ace of Hearts. They want to move on from the past. Move on from um, their fears. Move on from ego, jealousy. This person no longer wants to self-sabotage this union. Someone is coming back into... Um, to, to uh, reconnect. Mm -hmm. So that this relationship evolves, transforms. It's going to go through a transformation because now this person is ready. They're tired of being separated. So Virgos, this is your reading for the week of May 3rd through the 9th. Comment below. Let me know if this is your story. Share, like, subscribe, hit the notification bell. Be safe. I'm sending you love, light, peace, and healing energy. Thank you for watching. I will see you next time. Bye.